All right, much brew time. Playing some uh, green red werewolves in standard. Hmm. <clears throat> Man, this hand's so tempting because if we just draw a green source, it's actually really good. But I don't think we can take that risk because if we uh, this is like the last hand, but worse. Uh, all right. Maybe we can scry into a land. Well, I mean, for being a five-card hand, this is somewhat reasonable. We get Copter and Pacifist. Hopefully loot into some more stuff. Island for our opponent. Now, land and Copter. Pass the turn. So our opponent's probably a control deck of some kind, I would assume. Another island. Oh. All right, this is probably a Metalwork Colossus deck. Now oh, there's a land. Well, let's play a forest. Play Gaia Reach Bandit. Crew up our Smuggler's Copter so we can loot. Get it. Oh, deck! Moto, I clicked. I clicked you. Oh, Moto. You saw me. That's not a punt. I clicked. But I guess I clicked forward too quick. Oh, punished. Well, play Lamhole Pacifist. Crew up a Smuggler's Copter. This time we're going to make sure we actually attack. Get to loot. Discard a Mountain. Get in four, six. Oh, man. I have a feeling that we might actually lose exactly because we didn't get in that three damage. That seems like a realistic possibility. Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Opponent draws a card. Down to 13. And Seer's Lantern. And Hedron Crawler. And Hedron Crawler. Ooh, and our opponent's going to get frisky. Or not. We draw a copter. Well, one, two, three. Play Hellpack Resurgence. Crew up Smuggler's Copter. Yeah, if we had gotten in that three points of damage, our opponent would be forced to chump here. Well, do some attacking. Get to loot. Discard Smuggler's Copter. Now, opponent chumps anyway. Down to three. Pass the turn. Yeah, that missed attack could actually be the... Our opponent would be at zero now. They wouldn't really be at zero because they would have had to... They would have blocked differently. But we would have forced our opponent to block with Foundry Champion. There's Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Down to two. I mean, our opponent could still fizzle. Glass Blower's Puzzle Knot. Does some scrying. Only two cards in hand. And our opponent scoops it up. All right. Whew. Well, that was good. I mean, that was bad, but also good because we won. I guess we can just bring in more Hollowed Moonlights. And go down Arlen Cord and Gaia Reach. Sky Sovereign also just shoots down a lot of our opponent's creatures. Natural State also kills a lot of things. We could bring in Natural States, too. Maybe go down Blossoming Defense is not that exciting. I don't think our opponent has that much removal. Let's try it like that. Oh, wow. All right. Uh, natural State's good, but I think we got a mulligan. We don't have... Dak. Okay. Well, I guess we'll keep a Copter. We've been doing a lot of Mold of Fives. Opponent cracks Evolving Wilds. Opponent gets a... Mountain. Well, play game trail. Tapped. Pass turn. We won on a multi five last game, even with a missed attack. There's Prophetic Prism for our opponent. This hand is way worse, though. Well, Ireland Court something. Reveal a forest. Play Smuggler's Copter. Pass the turn. A creature to get to start attacking with Copter would be super sweet. There's Ether Hub for our opponent. And passes. Fake pass. Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Sure. 
Draws a card down to 19. Come on, creature. All right, pacifist is a creature. So play the forest. Play pacifist. Crew up smuggler's copter. Get in 4-3. Loot. Discard timber gorge and pass. So opponent's down to 16. There's Harold. Gonna make our opponent's stuff cheaper. Crumbling Vestige. And Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Alright, opponent's down to 15. Now let's see what we draw. Another Halpec Resurgence. Well, play the Mountain. Play Arlen Cord. Make a Wolf. Crew up Smuggler's Copter. Get in for three. Get to loot. Discard the forest. And pass turn. So opponents at 12. Hmm. Arlen Cord can't make a creature next turn, though. Arlen Cord would be so much better if you could choose all the options all the time. There's Ether Flux Reservoir. There's Prophetic Prism. Gonna gain our opponent some life. If our opponent can find a paradoxical outcome, we're probably dead. And a Metalwork Colossus, that's pretty big. And opponent passes. We draw a Cinder Glade. So what does this do? It can... Creatures get plus one, plus one, and trample. Not super exciting. Well, let's Lightning Bolt our opponent's face. Flip our Cord. Crew up our Smuggler's Copter. Play Resurgence. Attack. Loot. Discard a forest. Cinder Glade and go. So our opponent's down to 11, but one paradoxical outcome gains our opponent uh, essentially an infinite amount of life. Not truly infinite, but a lot of life. Seer's Lantern for our opponent. Trigger's Reservoir. Oh, God. That's a second Reservoir. Oh, that's so much life gain. Opponent gets in an Arlen Cord. Well, we might as well block. Let's make a wolf. If we can get our opponent to block, we can kill that Herald, which would be nice. Fire up Smuggler's Copter. Attack with both. Loot. Discard a Smuggler's Copter. Blocking, please. There's a the block. Alright. So we get to Halpack Resurgence. Makes our wolf a 4-4. Four, four. So at least we got rid of Herald of Kozilek. Makes it a little harder for our opponent to play a ton of spells. But still, they're gaining so much life. Gurupur Ori. Whoa! Alright. There is some super spice going on in this deck. Opponent passes. Well, we would like to get empty-handed to trigger Ori. Arlen Cord. Well, let's Lightning Bolt our opponent. Fire up Smuggler's Copter. Get in with Copter. So our main goal is to get empty-handed here to trigger Ori next turn. Loot. Blossoming Defense. All right, so we'll discard Arlen Cord. Hit our opponent down to seven. Play Gaia Reach Bandit. And pass turn. Uh, well, we're, we're kind of staying in this game. Things could go wrong at any instant. So, Hadron Crawler. Going to gain our opponent up to nine. Another Orrery. <laughs> My goodness. Okay. Opponent's passing. Well, 
attacks with metal work Colossus. We could kill it. Problem is they get it back, and that's another spell. Uh, let's just blossoming defense our wolf, and let Arlen Cord die. So now we get the orrery advantage. We draw three. Can we win here? Moonlight Hunt. Targeting Hedron Crawler. Are we really going to win? Nissa and our opponent scoops it up. Wow. Well, I mean, our opponent's not really playing a tier one deck, but our opponent had double, double uh, Etherflux Reservoir on the battlefield for like a million turns, and we somehow still dealt enough damage to win. Whoa! Well, that was a spicy brew, but we will take the win. Jeez.